All right, so Act 2 beckons on Saturday night. Piotr Jan approaching a 5-1 to one favorite after the first meeting was essentially a pick -em. Your thoughts on what we might see here Saturday? The ego took over in the first fight. He made a bad decision. I think he was in a dominant position and wanted to show how dominant of a fighter he can be. He needs to be smart in this one. And Aljo needs to demand some respect. He looked beautiful with the volume and the touches, but eventually Ige said, I mean, uh, Peter Jan said, I'm not getting hurt. I'm going to come forward, and he can't hold me down. He said, I am sad. I'm disappointed. <laughs> at the scarlet letter that we've placed on Aljamain yeah. Sterling because he got fouled and won the belt. He got fouled right. with a legal right. knee and won the belt, and yet we almost blame him. I am, I am excited for him to get a chance to redeem himself, and I look forward to him redeeming himself in this fight. Largely, I agree. I think there's a lot of Sterling venom out there that is unnecessary. Agreed. He's kind of gone half heel. He hasn't gone fully in. Mm -hmm. um, what type of fight are you expecting in the rematch? In, in, this, in this rematch, I just need to see a smart... Peter Jan and uh, Peter Jan. Uh, Al Jermaine, he needs to go and land these takedowns. You saw in the first fight, he's had tremendous success throughout his career landing these takedowns. He only got one takedown. Jan right. was able to pop right, right, right back right. up. And Jan was the one that took down Aljo multiple times in this matchup. He needs to get the takedown, do damage on the takedown, look for the submission. And again, power shots now and then. Volume is great. But if you're not hurting someone, yeah. they lose the respect and they start to come forward. And you have somebody like Jan coming forward, it's a, a night for disaster. Al Jermaine needs to use his length and he uses his length and his kicks. He needs to be able to disguise his shots behind those kicks, get in and try to get Peter Jan down. Now, the fact that Peter Jan is going to get back up to his feet can actually help Al Jermaine because that's going to give him access to his back. And we know that once Al Jermaine jumps on your back, it's a wrap. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.